about a company that sent me their nail kit so they sent me the company's name is nail reserve los angeles and they sent me all of these polishes these are gel nail polishes i got pinky pink which is so cute i got pink universe I chose my color, so you know I had to choose the different shades of pink. First and foremost, these are my real nails. I got them done. I saved this video so I could show you me doing my pedicure, but I'm going to talk to you a little bit about that later. But yeah, these are my real nails, um, just co um, covered with acrylic to keep them strong. And I actually cut them down. They were longer. So you guys know I love nails. I usually go between pink and lavender. The other color that I got was the Cherry Blossom. So these are the three colors that I got. So this is a nail kit. So they sent me, I didn't have any UV um, like gel nails. I didn't have that polish. One time I actually did get it and I didn't realize that you needed a special lamp to dry your nails. And I tried to dry them the regular way and they, it just never worked. So when I told them that I didn't have the UV lamp, they were like, why don't you try our kit? Which comes with nail polishes, everything you need, plus a mini UV LED lamp. So I was super excited. Got these colors, these three pink colors. It also comes with the base coat. It comes with the remover and it comes with the no wipe top coat. So these three here, plus it comes with cuticle oil. We need those cuticles to be nice and moist. And let me show you the UV lamp. So this is the mini UV lamp. And I was surprised because I was like, are they sure that they sent me a lamp? Because it is so small. So underneath, you have to, this is like the thing that holds it up. So let's say you just do like this. It is super cute. So it's great for travel if you want to do your nails. Like if you're traveling and you want to do your nails, you could definitely travel with this kit and then you just put your nails under like that. It comes with the cord so that you can plug it in and um yeah so that you can power it up so all you're gonna do is press it once to turn it on for 45 seconds then press it twice for 60 seconds and then a third time to turn it off new to gel nails i just started getting gel nails maybe about last year but i do realize too you have to be really really careful because i noticed some irritation of my nails and you have to wear gloves but i'm not going to be doing my nails i'm going to be doing my toes so this is it and it is just super super cute so in the video you are gonna see me doing my toes now i must say i am not the best at painting my toes but i had to give it a try so that i could show you how the polishes work and everything like that um i'm showing i'm gonna show you before and then a little bit after and if the nails are not perfect my toenails please forgive me because this is my first time doing it myself i normally just get them done but for those of you who are really good at painting your nails and stuff like that this is perfect for you because you don't have to worry about waiting for your nails to get dry you can quickly use the uv led lamp and i just still have to work on um like cleaning it up because like sometimes you miss the nail and then get around on your skin. I don't know how to do that just yet. So again, my pedicure is not gonna be perfect. I did it already, but you're gonna see in the video that it's not perfect. But what I can say is I really, really enjoyed this. I have to practice a little more and I have to practice with cleaning it up. I think when you wanna clean up the nail, you can use the remover and that should work just fine i tried to do it but again it's not perfect 
but I really really love the way the nails dried really really quickly I love the color of the nails I love the way that the top coat made everything look shiny and it just looks really really perfect and I really really like it so definitely give them a try I'm gonna leave all the information in the description and I'll have a special code for you to use so yeah thank you so much for watching hey you guys I am on my way to Hudson Yards it is Sunday I think August 18th or 19th and yeah let's go to Hudson Yards I have to refill my metro card I'm waiting waiting for that couple over there alright I paid my fare I'm getting on the train it is a it's a weird Sunday and I realized the last time that I went to Hudson Yards I was having a weird day I'm having a better already I have not eaten it's like five something and I have not eaten yet that goes to show you where my energy was going to other places but myself I did make a smoothie and brought some snacks with me so I'm gonna find a place to sit and eat first and then I guess I can figure out where else to go I'm hoping that it doesn't rain I don't know it looks like rain. Looks like rain. So I'm trying to figure out where the High Line is. I know, shame on me. I live in New York City. Don't know where the High Line is, but we're gonna change that. We're gonna find it. We're gonna find it. drink 
I wanted to try at Starbucks a matcha drink, but I already have a drink with me, so I have my smoothie, so that's gonna be too much liquid that I'm gonna be consuming. So I'll probably do that on another day, but that's why I got excited when I saw, saw Starbucks. I don't normally go to Starbucks. So I'm near the vessel. The vessel is right behind me. As you can see, when they first opened up again, people, um, so many people, there were so fatal accidents there. And so now it's closed. But you can still see it. That's Verano right there. It said join them for happy hour. Although I'm not a drinker like that, but I just want to see what's popping. Oh. They have it where you can come and watch movies and tennis. I think they also have like activities where you can um like do book like a book club or something like that. Like everybody comes to read a book and um talk and share. I actually signed up for that, but I never showed up. I signed up for the next one in September, so let's see if I can remember to. I totally forgot. I really, really, really forgot. But I feel good now that I'm around some people, and I'm gonna talk to you more about that when I find a seat. Wondering if, I'm wondering if I should just go sit over there and enjoy my smoothie. Temperatures are uh, pretty cool than it has been in a week, but you can see it's still right up there, so you get Both of these guys have it so far. Well, I'm gonna sit down. Because you see all these little seats. I wasn't sure if I had to make a purchase for something, but I guess not. They're watching oh, tennis. Okay. Coming off the back of 55 last season. That was so it. yeah, let me have my smooth. Last season ever was 20. Costing him a lot of matches. I think I'm going to go to Starbucks and get out. that, um, and reaching the Canada even the drink I wanted to try, a matcha latte, so I think I have to replace the milk, a lot of tennis milk with, with um, the travel it's milk. about to rain, look at these clouds, it is about Alex to rain, I was watching the tennis, tennis match, Representation. they close at 7, oh look at the rain, it's going to be so cute. I do not want to be caught in the rain. I do have my umbrella, but I don't want to get caught in the rain. But it was a really, really nice time. I did know about these events, but I forgot about it. And I'm like, I really like the vibe here. If you watch my other video, I think it was sometime last year I was having a bad day. And I came here and I felt so much better. The vibe here is awesome. I don't know why. I have not been coming so for the remainder of the summer I'm gonna be visiting a little bit more let me find Starbucks so I can get that drink I was talking about and that I was hearing about I'm trying to take some selfies before I go but the vibe here is so cool look <laughs> Oh, 
yeah i love outdoor activities especially in the summertime in new york city this is like super fun so we're going to starbies it's right over there wait oh i keep messing up it's right over it's over there we'll get there in a minute <laughs> latte with four pumps of vanilla so and I got my butter croissant right here so I'm gonna try to drink so you can know okay mmm <gasps> this tastes so good yes delicious love 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 it Give this a try. Thumbs up. All right, let me try my croissant. Look at it right here. Yummy. Mmm. So yummy. It's super yummy. Mm -mm. Oh, well, when I came here, like by the way, usually I start to feel better. Like the vibe here feels like I'm not even in New York City. It feels like I'm somewhere away, like on vacation. Mm -mm -mm. I'm not a Starbucks girl, but <laughs> this drink, I think it's a vanilla that makes it taste so good. It's so good. So I got the grande, next time I'm gonna get the larger size. It's so good. Really refreshing, that vanilla just tastes so up. and I'm headed back home. It didn't start raining yet, so I'm happy about that. Oh my gosh, this drink was so good. I drank it all up. Just ice left. It's so good. The croissant was good. 
I love it. I love, love, love it. I can see, you know, people saying they love Starbucks a lot. It is kind of pricey. I don't see myself getting Starbucks every day because I like to make my own drinks at home. But I feel like it's like a vibe. That's why people do it. But I'm over it. Like, I can make my own drinks at home. But it was definitely a vibe. It tasted good. I really loved it. I had an awesome time. I feel refreshed. I feel rejuvenated. And go back home, handle some things for the rest of the evening. So yeah, I think I'm going to end the vlog here. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can receive all of my uploads. And if you haven't seen my other videos, watch my videos. Also watch my shorts videos because I do a lot of the trending dances. I've been having so much fun this summer doing those dances. So yeah, so um, yeah, let me know how you like the video. Leave a comment and I'll see you soon.